it's one thing for these guys to have taken the time to learn our business and understand that we're worthy and why, but before they weren't able to do anything, it's, hey, I like you, you've got a great story, we see where you're going, but we just, I'm sorry, there's not enough assets to grab. And so literally, you talk about perfect timing, that accelerated growth program allowed the bank to not only vet us, but then actually be able to do something to allow a company like us to, to grow significantly without having to you know, bring on investors um, or go to Silicon Valley, right, and sell off part of the business to do it. So it's been huge for us. There are situations where companies are started, they're up and running, and then all of a sudden they get a large contract and have this very rapid growth or have the ability to acquire another business and grow rapidly. And it's very difficult for local financial institutions to finance those. So the Bank of North Dakota stepped in and created an accelerated growth program to provide funding for those businesses to get them over that rapid growth and the thought process is after that, two or three or four years, it becomes a normal part of their business and then they go on and go on with their traditional financing and they're off and running and everybody wins. Bank of North Dakota came in and uh, partnered with Choice. Uh, we probably wouldn't be able to get funding uh, in a lot of places in the country just because we are somewhat of an investment-backed company, not, not always, but have been in the last couple of years. We haven't been profitable on purpose. We've been growing revenue and growing team but to, at a point where we're losing money. And so traditionally a bank would have a heck of a lot of risk coming in and financing, say an acquisition like we made um, without a partner like Bank North Dakota. There would be a distinct possibility that maybe the company wouldn't be here or it wouldn't be growing without the assurances of the Bank of North Dakota uh, behind us. We just had such explosions going on and and the ability to raise capital and all of those processes that take place and the distractions from it, it would have been very, very difficult. It has allowed us to keep these software companies in the state of North Dakota, maintain an employee base in the state of North Dakota, and attract additional capital of the software companies, and to maybe help diversify the state of North Dakota from an industrial and a business perspective.